Hey guys, so today we are going to be taking a look at Easy Aid Tech Transforming Frieza. Now, this guy was my de facto favorite unit in the game when he released back during the 250 million download celebration three years ago. Finally, we have his Easy A, and uh, this guy's stats are pretty absurd. I actually sorted my box by attack. And he ended up being the 14th highest attack stat unit in my entire account. Now you guys know my account. I basically have every single unit in the game rainbowed. This guy has a higher attack stat than the six year anniversary LR UI Goku. That's how ridiculous this is. This guy legitimately has like very high stats, even for an LR. Um, the defense is still pretty good too. 11.7K is not bad. Um, I do have some really premium skill orbs on him, so we can take a look here. I have uh, the level 500 attack for bronze, level 5 additional for silver, and then I gave him the um, the, the extreme super battle road um, skill orb there, level 3 uh, crit, and then a 300 attack. So in total, he's getting an additional 800 attack from skill orbs, so without those skill orbs he would be at 21,200, but now he's over 22,000 with this. Leader skill is extreme class key plus three in HP attack and defense plus 130%, which is pretty good. That is the secondary part of the PyCon and Janemba's uh, leader skill pretty much there. The super attack effect is raises attack and defense and causes immense damage to enemy and lowers defense. So pretty much the same effect there where he just infinitely stacks his attack and defense and that's uh, that stays consistent until he gets to his golden form, at which point he raises attack and defense for one turn. Um, the passive, so this is where things get interesting. So he gets attack and defense plus 110%, key plus three, and an additional attack plus 10% and defense plus 40% when attacking a super class enemy. Recovers 11% health at the start of turn and then transforms when conditions are met. So the one thing I do want to emphasize with this guy is you'll see some pretty absurd defensive stats with this, you know, even just the first form Frieza here. But when he supers, he's getting a double whammy defensive boost because he's getting the 40% defense from the passive and the stack from the super attack effect. So, like, this guy's defense is absolutely insane. Um, and then on top of that, his link set being a Frieza unit is very, very good. Strongest clan in space, universe's most malevolent, metamorphosis, thirst for conquest, big bad bosses, fear and faith, and fierce battle. Once this guy gets to third form Frieza, he loses fear and faith uh, for shocking speed. And then once he goes to final form, I believe he loses metamorphosis for prodigies yep that's exactly what happens and then uh golden is the same link set as uh, final form so the teams that he's on he is on how many is this one two three four five six he's on 13 categories resurrected warriors movie bosses full power transformation boost wicked bloodline dragon ball seekers terrifying conquerors target goku revenge inhuman deeds gifted warriors planetary destruction and sworn enemies one of the two new categories introduced by the dual dokkan fest units this year for the worldwide download celebration now the one thing i'll say is uh, when i'm speaking to a lot of jp players they have the movie bosses stage of extreme super battle road which apparently is like the hardest stage in the game honestly uh, from what i've been told that's the stage where the enemies hit the hardest and it's just the most difficult overall this guy can be a very effective tool in there because like i just said he, his defense even turn one is going to be over 300k once he supers that's pretty dumb so even for an event or a stage like that that hits as hard as that stage does like this is going to be a pretty pretty powerful unit and a pretty good option for you to use in there um today we're going to be showing off uh this frieza on this team here um i didn't want to go too crazy i have so many videos to record so initially we're going to take a look at him on the transformation boost slash terrifying conquerors team I'm going to be using them alongside the STR cooler. They do share six links with each other, um, obviously before he goes into third form. But um, this is going to be a good team for him. Obviously him with the other Frieza slash cooler, you know, the whole Wicked Bloodline theme going on here should be looking pretty good. And just for the sake of being able to see all the stages of his transformation, we're going to be taking a look at this uh, guy on the legendary Goku event, the OG legendary Goku event here. So let's go ahead and jump in there and uh, let's just witness the monster in action. All right, so here we are up against the OG legendary Goku event here. Now, the one thing I will say about this Frieza is I believe he he's not on the um, Space Traveling Warriors category, which is something that I think he should be on. For some reason, none of the golden Friezas are included in that category, which I don't agree with, but it is what it is. 
So I'm going to go ahead and take the cooler team with him on it into this Legendary Goku event. Hopefully we get him turn one. I actually might just reset if we don't. Um, but we're going to be bringing some standard items here. Actually, I might just forego the mouse item here just to get a Dende so that we can have a regular healing item without any added effects. And then we're bringing the Icarus Kid Gohan support memory so we can maybe get a little bit of an additional boost from that as well. So let's go ahead and jump in. Um, and because we're going up against the Goku, uh, he's on the second turn. Actually, I'll, I'll just, it's fine. I'll leave him, I'll leave him there. Um, because we're going up against the Goku, uh, we'll be able to make use of the Int Frieza here, who is actually a pretty good linking partner with that Frieza as well. So actually, these rotations are set up perfectly already. So this is, this is perfect. Um, again, this, this legendary Goku event at this point is pretty old. It's not as hard or difficult as it once was, but that's fine. The goal of this uh, video here is just to see what kind of stats we're looking at for this Frieza, because one of the initial reactions I saw from a lot of people last night when this guy's kit was revealed was, you know, his kit isn't that good, he's kind of mid, he's not going to be doing as much damage, blah, 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 blah. So I want to prove you guys all wrong, <laughs> for those of you who think that. And this is turn one. Literally the first... Okay, so right now he has six links out of, out of seven, right? That's just what he shares with Cooler. Um, the last link is Fear and Faith. Actually, does Cooler have I mean, does uh, Turtles have that? No, he doesn't. Okay. So, turn one. 210,000 defense. Now, granted, there's a lot of support here, right? But that's just how the team is built. Remember, he's he's both stacking his attack and defense through his super attack effect, and he's getting a 40% defensive boost on top of that. I'm pretty confident this guy will have around 300,000 defense once he supers. Turn one. <laughs> For a TUR, that is very good. Keep in mind, he's going to be getting additional defense every turn from transforming, and he's going to continue stacking that defense every single turn. Let's go ahead and grab this. I would not be surprised if this Frieza just instantly annihilates Goku here. And um, let's just see what turn one looks like from this guy. All right, so he's at a 5.46 million attack stat. That's turn one. Instantly disintegrated. We didn't even have an opportunity to get an additional super attack, which would have helped because remember, he does stack infinitely, so <laughs> just he just does too much damage. All right, let's um, take care of this phase here. Let's do this. I don't expect to have many problems here. Toa, uh, we could also potentially see a turn if we end up falling below. I think it's, what is it? It's either 50 or 30% HP. The Toa gives us like that mega support boost. So maybe we can get that off. And at the same time, we'd probably end up getting the Icarus a Gohan support memory, so that turn would be insane. But, yeah, we'll make quick work of this Goku here, and then we'll move on to the next uh, next rotation. Okay, we're actually going to get super, that's fine. I think it actually, I think this uh, Toa's passive is 50%. She gives the massive buff. Let me just check. Right, so we're going to transform to second form here. Let me just see real quick. Toa. E, uh, uh, yeah, 50%. And you heal. Okay. So this Frieza, in second form, has no different links. So 252k defense. Remember, he's still stacking. He's still getting an extra. It should be 30% defense from the super in the second form. Yep. So we'll leave him in the first slot, and we'll go ahead and grab this. And I, again, I don't expect uh, this guy to be too much of an issue here <laughs> with this second form Frieza in slot one. Okay, go ahead and do your double digit damage. Yep. And then we'll hit you for a 5.8 million attacks. That sounds pretty good to me. <laughs> Almost one shot. <laughs> okay, and I guess from there, we'll move on to Super Saiyan God. Here's where things start to get a little bit more difficult in this event. Even though this is an older event, we can still get hit pretty hard here. Uh, this first form, Prime Battle Frieza, gets the majority of his defense once he supers. So even though he has 167k, you know, it's actually not bad. He's going to get a lot more once he supers. He's going to get an extra, I think it's 50% defense here. So hopefully he doesn't super us until we super first. But we we'll can't control that. Uh, I think we'll just go ahead and grab that. And we'll be able to transform into third form next turn. Oh, that's unfortunate. So remember, 
once Frieza goes into third form, he ends up losing Fear and Faith for Shocking Speed, which I would I would gladly take that trade off. I think that's a very, very good trade. Shocking Speed is a much more common link amongst Frieza units, so I will definitely take that. All right, so we'll be able to come in next turn with third form and pretty much just finish this Goku off. Uh, Toa is also going to be on rotation. We're not below 50% uh, HP, so we're not going to get that super, super buff, but we'll be able to get her normal support. I think Cooler should take care of this guy. Let's see. Or not Cooler, uh, Turles. Okay. Super Saiyan Blue. We have another AGL phase here. So there we go, third form. There's Toa as well. And we get the extra support memory. Okay, so we're going to be a little bit uh, inflated in terms of our attack and defense. Again, six links shared here. He's at 347k defense. And uh, let's go ahead and see what kind of attack stats we're putting up here. Let's do this. And uh, I honestly, there's a chance we just kill him. Like, there's a chance the tech Frieza solos him, <laughs> I think, depending on what happens here. All right, what are we looking at? 7.2. Okay. <laughs> no additional damage. If we, if we additionaled him, I think we would have killed him. Okay. So that's a pretty good attack stop. But keep in mind, it is a little bit inflated because of the support memory. But that's fine. I mean, support memory is so, something you just are going to take with you, right? All right, this is going to hurt. Um, but we should be fine. Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and this is actually not the best thing ever. I'm going to go ahead and just use this real quick so that we are for sure fine. Let's go ahead and do this. And we should be moving on to the next phase after this, assuming that we get uh, at least one crit here, I think. Seven million from this guy. Okay. If cooler crits, we'll, we'll move on. One thing I haven't mentioned uh, yet that I want to talk about real quick is the fact that one of this guy's best linking partners, in fact, I think I would actually consider him to be the best linking partner for the Transforming Frieza, is the physical Final Form Cooler. Now, he's not a bad unit right now on Global, for easy A, but physical Final Form Cooler, once he gets his easy A, I actually consider him to be like a legitimate like top contender for potential best TUR easy A. Like, I have him at... I honestly probably would say he is the single best TUR easy A. Um, so to have him on a rotation with this tech Frieza as a rotation with just two ridiculously strong easy A units is like a nuts rotation. All right, so only going to be able to get one attack stat in here with the Frieza because he's just going to die, right? Um, unfortunately, we ended up losing Metamorphosis, which we share with Cooler, so Prodigies is going to be the link there. Um, and the thing about this Int Frieza too is this Int Frieza has Shocking Speed and Prodigies. So when we have a rotation with this Int Frieza here, we can actually put the green, uh, the uh, tech one in the middle to get all seven links active. But for now, we'll have to do this. And he's at 346k defense here. Pretty good. Let's go ahead and grab uh, these here. And uh, goodbye, Goku. This attack is going to be pretty nice. Should be over 7 million, I think. Let's see. 6.82. That's, pre that's pretty good still. All right, so we're going to take him out. And that is the last time we're going to get a stack of attack and defense before he transforms into golden. I'm just going to go ahead and make sure that we don't die in this turn. So we'll go ahead and use this. And I guess we'll just go ahead and do that or something. All right. Um, so once this Frieza goes gold in the transforming Frieza, uh, a few things happen. Number one, he no longer infinitely stacks his attack and defense from his uh, super attack effect, but instead he gets a one turn raise uh, of 30% for both his attack and his defense. Uh, something else that happens is he no longer gains any sort of defense from his super, uh, from his passive, but he ends up gaining 50% attack when attacking a super class enemy, and he also has 12 key for one turn and performs a guaranteed crit. So for this one turn where we transform into Golden Frieza, he will guaranteed crit the enemy. Um, but again, this Goku can't dodge, so assuming he doesn't dodge, right? 
Uh, but this is going to be a pretty nuts attack set, I think, um, coming up here. Plus, we also have the Int Frieza on rotation, which means that we're going to be able to activate all seven of this guy's links right away. So here we go. Um, I'm actually going to put the Int Frieza on rotation just because he's going to be a much better tank. 406,000 defense. So keep in mind, because of the fact that he's actually raising his defense by th attack and defense by 30% for one turn, like he's going to be... Th th this guy's pretty much like, what? 540k defense or something like it's, it's pretty insane uh, maybe even a little bit higher than 540k once he supers so he's pretty much untouchable i would say uh, let's go ahead and do this and then we'll give the tech freeze all these for the healing we just get the full health i think yeah and uh this is looking pretty good here let's see what kind of numbers he's putting out hopefully he doesn't dodge us because he gets member this is not only is this going to be a high attack set, but it is a guaranteed crit for this turn, so... Alright, what kind of numbers are we looking at here? 8.1 million! <laughs> With like a 550k or something defensive stat, and we just instantly killed him. Okay, <laughs> pretty good. Alright, we'll take a look at maybe like one more rotation with him, and then I think we'll uh, wrap it up. Um, I guess we'll just let this play out. If we die, it's fine. I think we pretty much saw everything we needed to see from this Frieza here. Um, I'm pretty content with what we saw here. Let's go ahead and do this. Hopefully we don't get super right away. Okay, that's bad. <laughs> we, we might be dead here, yeah. Unfortunately. But, um, I think what we showed was pretty, pretty acceptable for the showcase. I don't, um... I don't think there's much more to show, especially with this team setup, right? I mean, this is pretty much his best scenario on this team, I think. Uh, a lot of the units are Wicked Bloodline, and they're going to share a lot of those Wicked Bloodline-specific links, right? Strongest Planet Space, and uh, Universe is most malevolent with him. Actually, we might live this. Wait, are we going to get the... We, we might get the Toa buff, actually, if we survive this turn. Yeah, we're... Okay. This is going to be an interesting turn here. We're going to get the Toa buff. Okay, so just a mega massive... I think it's 50% attack and defense, plus her normal support. Plus we get the heal, so uh, this Toa is pretty dumb. We get, we get the heal from her, plus remember, Golden Freeze is healing 15%. So we pretty much just full heal. We actually did fully heal. Um, and we put him in the middle. We get everything except for big bad bosses, unfortunately, because this Frieza does not have big bad bosses, which is obviously his most important link. But because we're getting this massive support buff, 347k defense, we're still going to be good to go here. So we'll go ahead and do this. I'll do this. And then we'll do that for you. I actually think this might be a little bit lower of an attack set than last turn. That's how important big bad bosses is. Like, big bad bosses is quite easily the best link. Okay, what, what, what are we sitting at here? 7 million, yeah, that, dude, that's a massive jump. We, <laughs> Big Bad Bosses is so important. It's crazy how important that is. Okay. Super? Oh, okay, how much does he eat from this? Type disadvantage against Int UI Goku in the Legendary Goku event. What kind of damage are we taking here? That's pretty good. <laughs> that's very acceptable. Like, a normal Tekken is taking, like, 400k plus from that. That is... That is very good. Very, very good. All right, I think that's pretty much everything we needed to see from this guy. Let me know down below what you guys think of this transforming tech Frieza. Do you guys like his EZA? Do you dislike his EZA? You think, maybe you think they could have done more for him. Um, are you content with it? Let me know. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I think what we'll do in the future is we'll go ahead and take this guy into like Super Battle Road and stuff, but that will probably be a separate video. I need to focus on doing other videos here because I have a lot to do. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you all in the next one.